Hey, today I want to show you guys how I clear up the hard drive on my Mac computers. Um, I watched a ton of videos on YouTube on how to do this and none of the videos I watched actually helped with my problem. So, um, editing all these HD movies all the time um, just clogs up the hard drive. It fills it up to where you can't even use your computer anymore, so I figured out how to delete all the copies of all your files on your computer and uh, it's pretty easy and it's extremely helpful because I've done it on um, my uh, both my MacBook Pros and my iMac like three or four times each so uh, here we go all right first we're gonna click this Apple symbol up at the corner of your computer and um, if you have a Mac older than 2010, I'm not sure exactly how you get to this menu, but um, anyways, we're going to click on this Apple symbol about this Mac, it's the first tab down, more info. Okay, we're going to click on storage. So I've already been working on deleting some files, what I did was cleared out my entire iPhoto library of all my pictures and all my video clips. Um, I dumped them onto my external hard drive and then I emptied them to the trash and I deleted the trash. So um, this purple section right here is all the video files on my computer. Now it was bigger but this yellow section is taking up three quarters of my hard drive. So that's what we want to get rid of, this other section, this yellow bar, and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. All right, under Finder, we're going to go to File, New Smart Folder. All right, once this window pops up, we're going to click this plus sign over here in the corner, and then Kind. Let's go to Other, let's type in File Size, okay, File Size. Let's click that, okay. Now we're going to find file size equals to, let's click the greater than one kilobyte. Now that will pretty much bring up all the files on the computer because one kilobyte is small. So this is what we're looking for. Go into this search bar right here and type frame, show all, all right frame and these numbers right here these are all the copy files that you want to delete if you delete one of these and say this is for a video clip or a picture um, and you didn't clear out your uh, your iPhoto library if you delete this first then you won't be able to view that clip you might be able to see the thumbnail of the video or the picture but then it'll have like a red icon on it saying it's in it's encrypted or there's a there's a problem with it well it's because you deleted this but that's the good thing that's what we want to get rid of what these are is just tons of this weird computer jargon you don't need that that's what's taking up all your space these little files are miles long of this computer code so and you have thousands of these on your computer so what you want to do is you want to highlight them all and then go up here, move to trash. All right, once you're deleting the files off your computer from the smart folder, you can close it and click don't save, it's not necessary. Then you want to go to the trash and all your files are still in the trash. So click empty trash. Are you sure you want to empty the trash? Absolutely. Let's see, over 3,000 items are being deleted right now. So, let's go back up to here and see how much space we just opened up on our hard drive. Almost clean. There you go, you got your computer back. I just, I just gave myself uh, almost 400 gigs back on this hard drive. Um, so, there you have it. All right, there's only one thing you have to worry about is not going delete crazy. Um, when you're deleting those files that say frame, sometimes there's like, there's files that land in between there. It doesn't necessarily go in alphabetical order. Just make sure you're not highlighting anything that you really don't want deleted, like your Safari or your iPhoto. 
So that's the only thing you have to look out for, but before you do all that, make sure you back everything up on your hard drive, on an external hard drive, so you've got your computer back. Thanks for watching, freaking give it a thumbs up if you like it, and uh, comment below. Let me know if this was helpful for you, and uh, see you guys next time. Let go.